Well, for over 60 years, the folks at Walinga have been all about building better products built to customer specifications. And last week at the 2018 Canada Farm Progress Show, we stopped in to visit with the good folks at Walinga USA. All right, so tell me more about the Walinga Ultraveyor system uh, with SmartFlow. It's a product that we've designed. We, came up, we started to work with these in the late 70s or okay. early 80s. It's designed for behind dryers or trans basically transferring product at long distances. It's push only, there's no vacuum on it. Um, some of the issues that we ran into over the years was damage with product because speeds, air speeds were too fast. Okay. We spent a lot of time, this is what we do, we do pneumatics. Um, we've came up, come up with uh, basically a smart flow which none of our competitors have. It, it, it consists of a VFD so we can get some control on the air speed by slowing down and speeding up the, uh, the, uh, the blower. Okay. Now this here is the basically the PLC or computer program that runs the runs the system. It senses the uh, how much product is coming into the system, and it adjusts the airspeed accordingly. So you get uh, maximum capacity with a minimal amount of damage to your product. But none of our competitors have anything like this. Okay. Typical our typical competitor buys the components in like a blower and an airlock. They marry it together, and here you go. Sure. They're not the experts, so we work towards the best possible air system you can get. And I would think if, if this is what you do only, uh, this would make sense for customers. Yeah, we we uh, we transfer grain anywhere from from the dryer anywhere to five six hundred feet away into uh, seven eight nine bins, uh, whatever. You don't need to do any trucking from the dryer to the to the bins. We transfer it all with just with a small pipe. Okay. And. Uh, yeah, it's just a, a, a real simple way. It's all computer programmed. You hit the button, it starts, it follows your dryer along. When the dryer shuts down, this thing shuts down. It's just very user friendly. And I would think folks would probably love a demonstration. Are there reps and dealers in the area that, that could do something? We have reps throughout the U.S. and Canada. Okay. We have a, demonstra a demonstration trailer that we drag around and we'll go to your uh, location, set up a, a, a a demo, transfer some stuff around. You can do some damage testing on your product, whether it's seed beans or or, or just corn, whatever. Um, we do a numerous amounts of product, right up to hemp seed. Uh, so yeah, it's a, we, we want to prove that we can do it for you. When we sell you something like this, we go to your farm, one of our reps will go to your farm with the dealer or, and it gets designed in Guelph for your application. It's because an air system is different at every application. Sure. It's not one size that fits all. We actually started as a, a company, we, we manufacture feed trailers for delivering animal feed. Uh, that was our our prime business. Okay. And we put a lot of effort into it over years because we believe that quality is number one. And if we sell you something and you're replacing parts constantly, that's not what we want to do. And, and what's kind of the, the general feedback you get from customers that walk through your, your, your booth here and, and have a chat with you? We, uh, every, every, every company has some customers that aren't 100% satisfied. I would say 99% of the guys that walk through here love our equipment. Um, they brag about it. Our biggest sales uh, thing is customers promoting us. It's, sure. Uh, and uh, we've been at it for many years. We stand behind our product because we build our own airlock, we build our own blower. It's designed for the grain industry. It's not, not designed for anything else but the grain industry, the high dust areas, all the stuff that come with moving grain. Sure. What would you say to customers that obviously, you know, aren't are watching this on, on TV or watching this online and can't walk through the booth themselves? What, what would you tell them? I, w I would say go online, check out for the local salesman, uh, Walenka salesman in your okay. area, give them a call. He'd be more than willing to pop by, take a look at what you're doing, and figure out what would work best for you. Thank you for being a part of the Machinery Pete Spotlight video.